We need to just make something clear first, our voices sound different than the previous parts 1, 2, and 3, as we have no control over the deletion of our old voices, and we know we sound like huge douche sacks now so bear with us. I want to welcome you again, you probably saw us on ZaraHedge.com before, and I am now here to bring you the money shot. Hold up the train here chief, can I talk? Sure go ahead, but seriously, you have no idea how big of an idiot you sound like. I've been hearing some pretty crazy things about silver and gold lately. Someone told me to sell, the bubble is about to burst. You sheep not too sure how many times we have to go over this. Price means nothing. Have you not heard, silver is a near zero contango now, just happened a few days ago. I am about to give you an education you never had. I know I know I had to watch the metals markets instead of the spot markets, go on. Zero contango means that there is not even one futures contract higher than the current price. It means there is heavy demand for immediate delivery. So is this good? This has never happened before in the history of the comics. Never. So this is good right? My friends if there was one thing we knew and wanted to this to go, it's zero contango. But I have even better news. I have been bombarded by more insider info than I can talk about from the JP Morgan all the way to the UBS. Yes, 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 give me the insider. LOL, be careful what you want to hear, because this may be why the governments and foreign central banks have been buying a record amount of gold bullion. Here's the insider info. During the office of B.J. Lewinsky, the United States wanted to unload their gold bars, but did not want to sell them at such low prices. So what did they do? Because at that time it was the tech stocks, no one cared about gold. Exactly. It was a great time to devise a plan to keep the Ponzi going. What I am about to tell you should be shocking. And should send chills up your spine and you might even cheat your pants again regardless of what people think of the fart sounds I add in. Here's the insider info. Recent insiders have told me 90% of the world's gold bullion is salted. Like they dip them in salt for preservation or something. No you donkey. Salted bars refer to Fort Tungsten. I hate to be the bearer of incredibly bad news, but many government vaults that were leased gold bullion near and around the B.J. Lewinsky era are gold-plated tungsten. You have got to be shitting me. You just make this shit up right. I wish I was. Central banks around the world are awash in fake bricks, and they know it. Well if they knew why would they be in uproar and demand their money back? Oh you sheep you have a lot to learn. There is nothing better to central banks than flooding the markets with fake gold. It makes their fiat paper worth more. It kept the Ponzi afloat for the 90s so we could buy VCRs, Nintendos, and SUVs. But now that the Ponzi is mainstream, like on Zero Hedge, the internet has exposed the currency cycle, and its time is up. Can I blow the whistle this time? So where do we go from here? LOL I haven't even given you the goods on silver yet. Well go on then I'm listening. World War 3 has commenced and you don't even know about it. There is being a war waged on the Ben Bernanke and the Fed, and on the other side we have other wealthy elitists. It's about to get really intense. So where does silver fit into this equation? I have just learned from the top of the food chain, that the next shoe to drop is the Comex. It is maybe 107 million ounces, but has physical obligations or IOUs on 720 million to the Asian and Euro Union elite. We know this already. The LBM and Comex are on fire. Tell me something I don't know. Okay sheep I'll give it to you straight up. Because of the insider war being waged right now, if the Ben Bernanke does not get his way, he will go kamikaze as they are about to take away his printing press. He will burn this motherfucker down before they take his press away from his death grip. Go on you got my attention. I was privileged to be a part of conference call that exposed where the end game is on silver. As we speak, right now, there is a global revaluing and resetting of currencies is happening right now this second. There is 50 trillion dollars about to be released from the global settlements that 140 countries are starting to cash in on. You lost me. Re-explain please. This seems important to the end game. 
the global settlements of over 30 years and the investment on Middle East invasions it is about to be released, and they are going to be buying precious metals while they sit and wait for the US dollar to die. What are you saying? I'm saying, if the one side wins, we are about to have an 80% precious metals and 20% gold-backed currency. And the Ben Bernanke will do anything in his power to avoid this. Well, what's that mean for silver? It means Blythe has a problem. How big? Very big. This new global settlement fiat is going to flood the physical markets, wipe out debt slate clean, and allow for the monopoly hotels to be put on the board again. They are selecting a new Mongol gold hoard. And the fact in that most London good gold bars are flugassy, we are set to rocket high. This is really good news. Yes it is. There is no possible scenario that silver could not get to a minimum of $75 with the next 18 months. I may be undershooting this figure. I will also come out and say that Blythe will step down and disappear by the fall buying frenzy. That will be the cue that we have succeeded and we are victorious. So has the Ben Bernanke changed his name to Joke yet? What do you mean? He should change his name to Joke Bernanke, because he is a fucking joke. Okay should I buy some more eagles then? I'm not sure, American silver eagles are considered legal tender. You may be holding government property. And in the event of confiscation you may have a problem. Never trust Uncle Sam with your physical. We will be back for more about this, don't you worry. You can read more on my blog about this at www.silvergoldsilver.blogspot.com And another thing, if you see gold go into backwardation, the end game has arrived. Oh boy.